Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. This Hall of Fame induction is truly a special time for me, a recognition that I will cherish forever. I am proud to join the company of the present and future members of such a prestigious Canadian institution. I want to thank my special friend, Mr. Stan Swartz, the Executive Vice President of the Calgary Stampeder Football Club, for taking the time to canvass the entire CFL in support of my Hall of Fame application. You may have noticed I am a little wobbly on my feet. My memory My memory is somewhat suspect. <laughs> my eyes are a little fuzzy. My hearing a little dim, and my voice a little less than strong. Other than that, I'm in good shape. <laughs> I was in Vancouver in the early 50s when I attended my first ever Great Cup Parade. It was a spectacular and exciting event. It was a Canadian football at its best. A major part of our sports history to be recognized and celebrated. As a Canada Safeway employee at the time and moving up the ladder of authority, I was in a position to strengthen the backstage football operation with the business world. Firstly, with the BC Lions, then with the Saskatchewan North Riders, and finally, the Calgary Stampede Football Club. I passed along my Safeway experiences to maximize promotions, sponsorships, and job opportunities for the players. In 1965, I moved to Calgary and joined the Stampeders as a director and later as a president and then as an advisor until 2007. I joined the McMahon Stadium Society in 1975 as president and quickly realized that major facility changes were required if sports were to survive at McMahon Stadium. As a first step with the installation of Island Surfer in 1975, the stadium was converted from professional use only to total multi-purpose operation and professional communications, demanding some 400 to 500 events each year. Sports occupies a special place in the Canadian history and culture. It is an important part of our heritage to be preserved and cherished. In today's world, it is essential that we provide our young people with the opportunity to grow through sports of all kinds and at all levels. Should you ever want to experience a good feeling about our young people involved in sports, attend a league football game at a stadium and watch the tiny toss, no bigger than a minute, dressed in full 
football gear, play with determination, visualizing themselves as future stars, playing in front of thousands of football fans. As president of the society, we began looking for ways and means of raising money to further improve facilities at no cost to the University of Calgary and the San Peter Football. To date, we have completed some $34 million in facility improvements and designed to increase game day income of Stampede Football Club. In addition, we have been successful in raising a further $15 million to cover improvements now in progress to be completed following the Grey Cup game in Calgary in 2009. The CFL draws its strength from the dedication of its volunteers and astute business leaders. In the early days, Commissioner Jack Gadar guided the ship. He was a rock. Today we have Commissioner Mark Cohen making solid decisions after strengthening the backstage operations. Canada has become a major place in the world of sports. Making the U.S. Sugar Bowl performance with our own Great Cup final. Olympic podium finishes in gold, silver, and bronze. Stellar men and women's gold, which will go down in history as hockey classics, including team individual first place finishes and all other venues. Canada shines bright, and we, with pride in place, will stand proud and let the whole world know we are Canadians. Thank you.